Hello there and welcome to the shop. Just a little bit of an update this weekend as I've ordered the ball screws for the new CNC conversion and there's going to be about uh, uh, probably four, four, between four and six weeks before they get here because they're coming in from China and uh, with the Christmas rush well you know you can't really tell so you know I've got lots of other work that uh, I need to do that I'm going to film some of. I'll show you something of what I'm going to do. Okay so here is the mill that's all stripped down and I've actually taken on a bit of a job for a friend with this beautiful blackwood. Uh, this is an inch and this is an inch and a half. So I'll, I'll actually uh, turn this one over so I'll stop the camera a sec. Okay so this is the finest blackwood that you can get. Uh, I'll show you a blackwood tree in a minute. Okay, so um, I've got a friend that's asked me to make a table. Um, and he has chose this, this wood to make it out of. Incidentally, this is extremely expensive wood. Just these two pieces here are $200 worth. So you can, uh, you know, you can imagine. There are slight, well, I don't suppose you could call them imperfections. There's you know, sort of inclusions in the wood. Um, don't exactly know what they're from, but uh, it's very, very nice wood anyway. Um, this is going to be the base actually, and this is going to be the top. It's going to be cut in half. Um, and anyway, I'm going to make uh, a, a nice table for him with a central column of redwood. Which I've, so I've got to laminate these up. Um, and indeed cut these in half. And as, you, you know, as you've seen, they're rough sawn on the outside and the other side. So... I'm going to be putting them on my CNC router, which is over there, my big one, um, and you know, skimming these off and uh, planing them with my CNC router. And I'll be making individual videos um, doing this. You know, I'll make a, a, a video with Cavco uh, doing the um, the tool paths. Uh, then I'll do another video of actually uh, cutting these in half and putting them on the the CNC router and um, skimming, well, skimming them down, planing them. I got a beautiful two inch cutter that'll do that just nice. So I'll show you how to do it. Well that's one job I've got planned that I'm going to be doing next week and um, when I finish that I'm going to be starting to do the wiring for this lovely little Queen Ant CNC router. So I want to get that up and running as well before Christmas. So, um, you know, there's plenty of work for me to do and film. Uh, and indeed I have to, uh, I want to strengthen, put more strengthening in that um, base there for the mill. So uh, I actually now got to sort sort somewhere out to to store this mill. So what I'm going to do is just roughly you know I'll put the base on here, put the column on the back and I'll put the saddle and that back on just loosely safely but loose um, and I'll store the head somewhere else. Um, just to get it off the bench because I'm going to need you know, all the bench to uh, joint this up. You know, after I've planed it, I need to um, to to join it. You know, two together um, and glue it up, as well the 
central column and I'll show you the, the building of that as well. And in between doing those jobs, obviously I should be doing some uh, laser work with the fender laser as well. So um, I think I'm going to be pretty busy between now and Christmas. So uh, there's a little bit of an update for uh, subscribers and patrons and all the other viewers. And I'll see you on the next video. So it's bye for now.